sections that are renowned for testing both bikes and their riders. You've got to know what you're doing. The current pace is a bit too docile for some riders who are looking to create a breakaway. There's a breakaway! Counter attack by Dylan Ronewagen. There's now more than a minute between the breakaway and the pack. The breakaway is not to everybody's liking. The peloton has significantly increased its speed. The pack is slowly whittling away the lead. The pack is increasing its work rate. Some teams can't be happy with the breakaway. The lead over the pack is dwindling. Several riders are attempting to break away. Riders run enormous risk of injury on cobbled sections, but as the saying goes, it's the historic races that make the rider and not the other way around. A couple of teams have set themselves up as pacemakers for the pack. They obviously don't have anybody in the breakaway group. A rider has a flat tire. Let's hope he has helped out quickly. Some team managers mustn't appreciate the fact that there is a breakaway, given that the pack has increased its speed. Puncture for a rider. A fall has just happened in the peloton. Several riders are on the ground. A rider is down, and he's not going to be able to carry on. Let's hope it doesn't jeopardize the rest of his season. Withdrawal of a rider. He seemed to have neither the energy nor the courage to keep going. De Boucher has fallen. Another flat tire. 
And here are the dreaded cobblestones. I know several riders who would prefer to be at home in front of the telly. Only a few riders are capable of following the very fast pace up front. It's an attack! That's another rider with a flat tire. The road is really treacherous. Apparently, there's another puncture. Your riders really should pay more attention to their choice of tires. The riders have to have their wits about them on this dangerous section. You never know what's going to happen on cobblestones. A small group of riders are trying to get clear of the bunch. Yet another flat tire. It seems to be catching. We're already at the halfway stage. Swift acceleration by Stefan Kuhn. Somebody's taking a tumble in the main bunch. The breakaway is not to everybody's liking. The peloton has significantly increased its speed. There's another rider with a puncture. The sides of the road are not a tire's best friend. The riders really have to be vigilant on this cobbled section. The vibrations really take it out of you. The pack is increasing its work rate. Some teams can't be happy with the breakaway. There's another rider with a puncture. The sides of the road are not a tire's best friend. There's a report over the radio of a rider coming off his bike. But apparently, he's back in the saddle. Apparently, there's another puncture. Your riders really should pay more attention to their choice of tires.
They really are moving. The pack can't get strung out too far, or it's going to start breaking up. A couple of teams have set themselves up as pacemakers for the pack. They obviously don't have anybody in the breakaway group. I can tell you that riding on cobbled sections is a real challenge. The racers have to have the talents of a tightrope walker as the grip of the tires can't be counted on. That's another rider with a flat tire. The road is really treacherous. The pace seems much too high for many riders. Yet another flat tire. It seems to be catching. A couple of teams have set themselves up as pacemakers for the pack. They obviously don't have anybody in the breakaway group. Another flat tire. Crossing a cobbled section is a technical exercise. That's why some specialists don't hesitate to reconnoiter a route several times because each section has its particularities, and on some sections, it is make or break if you don't adopt the right strategy. This is the last third of the race. The team leaders have their minds fixed on today's goal. Another flat tire. It seems to be catching. Oh my! I can see her rider on the tarmac! Thank goodness he looks fit to get back in the race. Peter Sagan is off. Counter attack by Oliver Nason. De Boucher has fallen. There's another rider with a puncture. The sides of the road are not a tire's best friend.
Now the guys up front are asking serious questions of the riders in the rear as more of them are left in the wake. Another flat tire. A rider is down! This year, some sections have seen their cobblestones refurbished, but I can assure you that it doesn't mean renewed. They still remain a significant difficulty. Attacked by Sagan. I think I saw a few riders on the ground. Counter attack by Oliver Nason. That's another rider with a flat tire. The road is really treacherous. Apparently, there's another puncture. The riders really should pay more attention to their choice of tires. Christophe Laporte goes on to the attack. Some riders try to use the verge to avoid the cobbles, but it's at the risk of getting a flat tire. Watch out, a team leader is falling behind. Christophe Laporte goes on to the attack. Apparently, there's another puncture. The riders really should pay more attention to their choice of tires. That's another rider with a flat tire. The road is really treacherous. Some cobbled sections are very narrow, so it's important to be well positioned to avoid falls or breaks in the peloton.
There's another rider with a puncture. The sides of the road are not a tire's best friend. Another flat tire. Falling behind, a team leader is falling behind. Another flat tire. It seems to be catching. Over the cobbled sections, a rider has to up his awareness to avoid falling, and those that are on their last legs don't have the necessary physical resources to do so. Another flat tire. It seems to be catching. Another flat tire. behind a team leader is falling behind there's another rider with a puncture the sides of the road are not a tire's best friend 15 kilometers to the finish line counter-attack by John Degenkolb
Apparently, there's another puncture. The riders really should pay more attention to their choice of tires. There are just 10 kilometers left. One thing's for sure when it comes to cobbled sections. There will always be a fight at the front as the riders enter. It's vital to be at the front to avoid falls or breaks in the peloton. There's a faller in the pack. A rider is flat on the road. That's another rider with a flat tire. The road is really treacherous. We're into the last five kilometers. Peter Sagan is off. Counterattack by John Degenkolb. And there goes the mad burst for the final sprint. Superb victory for Sonny Colbrelli. Waiting for the back markers who appear to be fairly numerous in this difficult race. Yet another flat tire. It seems to be catching. <laughs> 